Hey there, this is Joaquina with Modern Homemakers. If you haven't already done so, click subscribe. Join the party, join the family. Um, anyway, today I am popping on here real quick. I was actually about to mail this blankie off and I was like, oh, I should do a review video really quick. So anyway, um, this is the second, here, I'll hold it up for a second here. This is the second blankie that I have made from this company. This one, um, you could get it for sale, but it was free. And so I'm cheap, so I did the free one on the website. So whoop, I'll try to put it on the table in a second so you can see um, some more detail, but I absolutely loved this blanket. And it works for girls and boys. The first one I did um, was blue and white, and then I did a pink and white one. So this is, this is pretty exciting. This is my cousin's first grandbaby, so. That was just really special to get to do that one. So anyway, it is by Daisy Craft Farms. I will put a link in the description so you can go find this pattern too, but it was totally free. And well, you gotta buy your yarn. Um, anyway, but I used, um, I did not use the yarn they recommended. This is one of the store brands at Joann's. Um, I will link it, I cannot remember. Something with a T, something save, something whatever. Um, I don't know, pregnancy brain. I can't remember what it's called. Anyway, I loved this blanket. I made it twice, once for a girl, once for a boy. And um, really, you know, there's always like help with a video for anything that's confusing. It was very basic stitches. It was just this getting this set up where you have the offset triangles. So, um, you know, this set of triangles comes over toward the right and then this one doesn't. And um, just like, you know, I'll put a thing here if you haven't seen the other one I did from them, but I had another video, uh, another pattern I did of theirs and it was squares. And just like with that one, you would think this would be a million threads that you're hiding, but it's not because instead of cutting every time you switch from white to pink or pink to white, you were hiding and carrying that other yarn color through with you. So it's just tucked in. It's really hard to see. I'll try to, yeah, it's, it's just so hard to see, which is why it works so well. But if you look really, really close to the sides of the rows with the white, you can see just barely like white thread in there. And that's because it was carried through each time. So, oh, the, the, the white's actually showing a little bit better. If you look inside this triangle, you see the pink in there? You have to be looking for it. So I can't tell you how much time it saved by um, just doing that. And it was just a really simple border. Um, it's like a nice ribbed effect. And, oh, I've got a little helper. You wanna help me? Oh, anyway, this is Katniss. Katniss, say hello, say hello. She wants to be in everything I'm doing. Oh, no. Um, anyway, I, it just worked up really quickly. Um, I love this pattern. Can't praise it enough and um, Go check out Daisy Farm Crafts for yourself. I'll put a link down there and you can make it if you like it too. So I didn't follow this pattern totally exactly. I made it a little bit longer because I took so long to make this one because we were remodeling that um, baby was not tiny baby anymore. So anyway. And I have the other one down here just to point out. So I'll put a link right there. But this is the other blanket that I made from Daisy Farm Crafts. And isn't that the cutest? This is the one I made for my son. And I also made another one in different colors for a cousin. So just loved. They just have such an aesthetic for baby blankets. I just love them. I love the geometric shapes. And um, it's how everything's not all lacy and frilly and whatever. And I'm actually working on a third one from them right now because I am pregnant with baby number five here. And um, I was like, oh, what I do? It's gotta be different. So anyway, this one's for a little girl. So I have lots of fun. Um, I'll show you that one later. I'll do a review on that one later. So anyway, more to come on these baby blanket reviews of these patterns, these crochet patterns. So all right, have a great day.